All right, so another run of the secondary air injection system while starting from cold and uh, outside temperature it's 13 and a half degrees so now I'm just gonna start my try to remember torque just waiting for the screen to come up actually I'm gonna put it over here okay so seems it's connected now just real-time information and we're gonna go to boost nav or is, there's the system the screen all right so let's start I think also I need to put a clock okay here the pump comes on because I can hear the pump running so that's the vacuum that's the coolant temperature this is the engine load and that's indicated close the open loop and that's indicating the air status Okay, so nothing else is running, the air conditioning is off, temperature still 13 degrees, and we keep running, and I just don't have the time count, which I should have done, but I can probably tell if it's running too long or not. That feels like about 45-50 seconds. Okay, so the system is off. So now it worked fine. That felt like almost to me 50 seconds, but probably was like a minute and a half. Yeah, definitely the, the system is off. It's still running in open loop because the coolant temperature is still low. Actually, let's see when does it switch to closed loop. Right now is 49 degrees coolant. So 50. See the vacuum is floating around 18.4. When the RPM drops a little bit, I get a, about Still running an open loop. Okay, so now it's switched to closed loop and it's using O2 sensor. Now, funny enough that the pump didn't start it the second time usually 
starts for another two seconds. Not today.